Fallout 4, boy have we been waiting a long time for this game, and now with the initial release of the game comes its flaws and also some major improvements from the previous games. Without going in any specific order, here are the top 5 things that Bethesda did right in Fallout 4. Coming in at the number 5 spot is the newly introduced feature called Settlements. These are given to you by any non-playable characters or can be stumbled upon in the wasteland itself. These locations can be customized to your liking while you're attracting new settlers to your location and also building however you want freely with no limitations, well, except the building limit, but that can be easily glitched because, you know, Bethesda games are <laughs> pretty buggy. And at our number 4 spot is also a new feature that was introduced in Fallout 4, and that is voiced yes, characters. Yes. Now everybody had a small fear that, that Bethesda has gone too far with voiced characters, kind of breaking immersion of Fallout, and they just thought it would ruin the flow of gameplay because it was left to the player's imagination of how your character would speak the lines decided in previous Fallout titles. But this turned out to be a success. While some aren't a fan of the voiced characters, others loved it. Personally, I loved it. It's a new feel to the Fallout universe. and they've done it right. And now at our number 3 spot comes the perk chart. The perk chart is a simplified version of the perk system in the game, which allows you to develop your character however you want at any point in the story. With various upgrades to different perks, with different tier levels, with different abilities, the perk chart is an overall major improvement that they've added to Fallout 4 that really changed the flow of the gameplay, but in a good way. And at our number 2 spot, which is completely non-gameplay related, is the beefed up power armor. I mean, look at the power armor in previous games, you know, the look was there, the look was pretty cool, but it just didn't really give you that feel of tough, bulky armor that you can wear on your character that will turn him unstoppable until the duration breaks on it, however. In Fallout 4, they've taken the original idea of power armor and improved it to add customization with different paints that can give you different abilities without having to sacrifice the current equipped armor you have on now, along with cosmetic improvements such as a jetpack to reach higher areas that you can't normally reach by any normal means. And finally, at our number one spot is gun customization, which actually gives purpose to various different objects found in the wasteland that in previous games had no purpose. Now they do. Let's say you find a sniper rifle like this one. Bolt action, not really the greatest, no stock, no long barrel. Bring it to a workbench, upgrade the barrel, upgrade the stock, and just overall make your gun a better weapon than how it originally was when you found it. But guys, that concludes the top 5 things that Bethesda improved on in Fallout 4 that worked greatly with the game. Do you have any suggestions for what Bethesda improved that you like or you dislike? Leave it in the comments below. But thank you guys for watching, and stay safe out there in the wasteland.